Hello, James Le Shark here. See what I did there? James, because I'm dressed like James Bond. Because we're going to James Bond Island today, so we're going to head up into Pangnar Bay. We're going to follow that long tail. We're going to go into Pangnar Bay. We're going to do some canoeing and we're going to do some exploring. And then we're going to go on to James Bond Island. That's right, the James Bond Island that was used in The Man with the Golden Gun. Mmm, there's my James Bond knowledge. I've dressed up quite nicely, I think. I think I look quite good. Although Captain did say, who's behind cameraman Alex at the moment, hi cameraman Alex, by the way. Um, Cap <laughs> Captain did say I looked like I was going to go and play snooker, which I thought was a bit weird. But anyway, we're not going to play snooker. We're going to go to James Bond Island. Uh, before we do, please make sure you like and subscribe. Subscribe and like, like and subscribe. Right, cameraman Alex, are you ready to go? He's ready. Captain, are you ready? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yes. Boatman, are you ready? Big thumbs up. I'm ready. Let's go. James, hold on. James Bond, he does this. James Bond, hang our bay. No, no, Alex. Alex, no. They don't need to see that bit, Alex. Alex! Thank you. Right, go. And all that kind of jazz. Hello. Um, right, so we're at our first stop. As you can see, there are little drops of sunshine falling from the sky, but on this trip to Pangnar Bay, it actually makes everything amazing and it's really lush and beautiful when you get little drops of sunshine and they'll be gone soon anyway. But as you can see, when we came out, even though it is a bit overcast and a little bit stormy, Pangnar Bay is pretty flat. It's pretty nice this time of year. Right, so this is our first little stop behind me. And Alex has informed me that this is called Mangrove Cave. Is that right? right? And apparently, Alex has said that we've got to swim down into the cave. Is, right. is that right, Alex? Okay, so we come here because at the, or the, this tide level because the crowds aren't here. So when it's low tide, you can actually walk into this cave and that's when everyone comes here. So it's a really good idea to come here at this tide level. Yeah, you have to float in there and it's a pretty easy float, isn't it? It's not too bad. So we can float in there and we're gonna go and have a look inside. Are you ready? I'm ready. It, it, is it, I'm, yes, I'm ready too. Do I have to have a torch and a hat and stuff? I got everything for you. Everything for me. Five Star has everything for us. Brilliant, right, let's go. I like caves. Alex, hold on. <laughs> I've got anything in my pockets. I, oh, nothing in, pocket. nothing in my pockets. I don't think so anyway. Woo! Alrighty. Let's go. I just want to show you what I look like. I got my torch on. Is it, it's not on though. Alex, come back. <laughs> Your one's not working. <laughs> no, I know. I haven't turned it on. Oh, I don't know how to turn it on. Oh, is it? Oh, there we go. Right, let's go, man. Oh, this is cool. Check me out. See a boat. Woo. How comes your walking? Oh. Okay, we're in. New fashion with Alex with his buoyancy aid, like a nappy. This is cool, huh? Wow. Hey, look. Hello, there you go. There's a torch in your face. So we're in the cave now. This is wicked. This is really cool. What are you pushing away? What, what, what are you pushing away? Sometimes we get the Oh, okay. So when you're splashing, you can see Oh, that. I thought you were getting rid of nasty animals. Check that out. What's that? These rock formations are amazing. That's so cool. Alex, don't go too far away. Oh, this is the coolest thing ever. We just do like a duck walking. You see this wow. Keep a little bit on the right. Yeah. Okay. We've got some rock here. This is awesome. Yeah, that's awesome. Crystal. Like yeah. Diamond. Diamonds. It's like Rihanna. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, this is so cool. So at low tide, you can actually, this water's all yeah. gone, is it, yeah? Yeah, just no water in here. But on that time, you got like a bunch of people who came on the same time. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. I, I don't want to show my people like that. My people? <laughs> my Alex, the dictator. <laughs> this is okay for kids as well, isn't oh, it? Sure. This is absolutely fine. Yeah, last week. I bought the uh, one and a half years old swimming in Absolutely. This yeah. This is totally safe. <laughs> oh, look at the crystals. <gasps> I'm not sure if the camera will get those. Look at that. You can feel the water push you out, right? A little bit, yeah. Yeah, because the tide is coming out now. So that means every minute our cave here bigger and bigger. If you came here when the tide rising up, you have to know how much longer you can stay. Alex, if you wanted to kill me now, <laughs> <laughs> you oh. could murder me and oh. no one would ever find me. I actually have... What do you mean actually? No, don't say that. We have a luminescent. You want to no. see? Yeah, go for it. We have to turn off the light. Yeah. I'm not really sure they show on the camera. See that? Hang on, look on the left. Three, two, one. See? I, I can see it. I'm not sure if the camera can see it because uh, I yeah. can't see you. Oh, there you are. Yeah. I think it's got more of it. <gasps> okay. This is one of the coolest things I've ever done. <laughs> really, really like this. And yeah, last time we came, the water about this high. And yeah, you know, I should really show you that small gap to get in. Oh, I can see the lagoon now. I can see the light coming. Oh. This is truly spectacular. Oh, look, you can see the stalactites growing. So here you can see the minerals dropping down and that's going to create a new rock formation. Look, you can actually see the water dripping down. That's coming through. Wow, that's so cool. Ooh. Oh my God, holy moly. Check this out. Welcome to my office. Holy crap, you've got the best office in the world. Yeah, it's beautiful here. Check this out. This is amazing. Oh, look. Now, as I said before about when it's raining, Pangar Bay is beautiful. It's just raining in this lagoon, so everything's bright and the leaves are bright. It's fantastic. Even With only people green. here. Yeah. yeah, it does. It makes everything more green and lush. It's stunning. Wow. This is amazing. You have to come here. Have to, have to, have to come here. I try to explain to tourists a lot, like, Please don't cancel the trip, even it's raining. Although you do look a, a bit weird. <laughs> <laughs> no, I agree with you. Yeah, sure. Alex was saying earlier, we was on the boat, when it is raining, look how beautiful it is. See, you can hear the sound of the rain and look. It's amazing. <laughs> look how lush it is. And the great thing is, we're alone in here. This is almost kind of... <laughs> It's romantic, Alex. Are you feeling romantic? <laughs> Is that a bit weird? Should I... Luckily, we've got protection on. <laughs> we got protection. Exactly. <laughs> wow, this is stunning. Train, lagoon, nobody else around, just me and Alex. This is amazing. Really, really, really amazing. <laughs> Alex the duck. <laughs> you save your head <laughs> from the rock. And then the water will push you out. That was amazing. Thank you, Mr. Alex. You're welcome. Right, so that's the first stop on our little James Bond Pangnar tour. Where are we off to next? Uh, we're going to swim into uh, Oyster Cave. We're going to go to Oyster, we're going to go swimming in Oyster Cave. This time we didn't have to swim. Yeah. This time we have, we had to swim that time? Uh, a little bit swim, a little okay. walking. 
Well, that was amazing. So Oyster Cave. Right, you ready, Captain? He, he, he nodded. He went, he did that. Really good for the video, that is, when he nods. We're not looking at him. Captain, Oyster Cave. Lau! Captain's always ready, aren't you, Captain? Yes, he's nodding again. <laughs> okay, so behind us is what's known as Oyster Cave. So this is our second little stop on our James Bond Pang Na Experience. Um, so we're going to uh, go in there? Yep. Down there? Yes. Sure? It looks a little bit small, but when you get there, it's big. looks a little bit small. It doesn't look like there's anything. <laughs> All right, cool. Oyster Cave, let's go. Let's do it. Well, I'm not doing it now because you told me not to. Put your feet down. It's like you're walking. Put your feet down. Easy. I can't hit the bottom. Oh, you mean like that? <laughs> oh, I can see why it's called Oyster Cave now. You don't want to be touching these things because nope. <laughs> you will get cut to watery. Wow. There's plenty of room for... Yeah, there is plenty of room, but you've got to be really careful with these oyster shells. You're trying to be in the middle of the... Yeah. Of the so if yeah. you didn't... Don't get close to the rock. Yeah, you don't want to get close to these oyster shells, but it is stunning. It's another cool experience. There. I'm not the owner. <laughs> oh, sorry, sir. Okay. <laughs> Alex is the Oh, it's quiet, isn't it? Yeah. Alex is the owner. Hi, guys. How are you doing, How are you doing all right? Doing well. This is stunning, huh? Really wow. Yeah. This is really new program for Five yeah, Star Marine. We, yeah. we took people swimming in the cave, like where people don't want to go, but we want to show you. We were, I was a bit scared, but now I'm like, no, well, yeah, I, I understand. It's yeah. totally worth it, yeah. Every day we got that plum plum, but when you in the first one, and then I'm really sure you want to do it again. They are the first <laughs> customer of our company for the new program. Wow, so check you out. You are late. Uh, I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's what Sean says a lot as well, that I'm late all the time. <laughs> anyway, you guys enjoy. We're going to go and do a... Oh, the echo. Yep. <sighs> Sorry, I've ruined your really peaceful no, little shot. Cold, we'll get out of your shot. Enjoy yourself. Thank you very much. Yeah. Right, one thing you can do on a five-star marine tour is you can get a little inflatable kayak, can't we, Alex? And Alex is very kindly going to paddle for me, so it's a bit like when we're in Venice. You're going on a, on a gondola, and you're my gondolier. I don't know if that's the right word or not. Anyway, let's get in. Captain, hold it, hold it for me. Don't let me... Oh. Okay, slowly, <coughs> oh. slowly. Oh. oh, my God. Okay. okay. Yes. Thanks, Captain. Bye. Bye. See you. See you. So I'll hold this up here. Alex, I, <laughs> I do feel like a prince with <laughs> Alex behind me. So we do have a selection or we do have a few inflatable canoes that we will have on the boats. But when we come to a place like this, we can hire some as well, which is what Alex has done today. And Alex is paddling for me. Where are we going, Alex? We're going to Hong Island Lagoon, which is very cool. All right, we're going a different way because we don't want to go that way where all those people are. Hello, everybody. Woo! They look happy. This is cool. I might just lie back. Am I going to put my head on that? Yeah. Oh! Oh, Alex. Oh. Thanks, mate. Oh. This is a life. You splashed me a little bit. 
All I need is a little pina colada right now. That'll be lovely. So one of the cool things about going out on a little inflatable kayak or any sort of kayak or canoe, you can get really up close and really see the stunning rock formations. They're beautiful. And also remember, if you don't want a canoe, you don't want a paddle, you just get someone like Alex. He does it all for you, it's great. Good job, Alex. This is what I love to do. I've done this about 14 years. 14 years he's been paddling around here. Yeah. And two years, no. He didn't use a paddle before. Yeah, look. Keeps him fit and healthy. This is stunning. Check this out. It's a great shot. It's a good shot. Look. Checking out their selfies. That's the shot. I do feel like the Queen of Sheba at the moment, which is very nice. Look at the lagoon right in front of you. Oh, okay, sorry, I'm meant to be filming the lagoon right in front of me. There you go. That's not a lagoon, that's just a gap. No, it's a lagoon. Is it a lagoon, is it? Oh, wow, okay. See, this is a great thing about the kayaks and the canoes that you can get, that you can do come into places like this that you probably wouldn't be able to get into normally, which is very cool. Wow, that's awesome. Check that out. That's very cool. Okay, so a top tip is to come early on these Pangnar tours. So if you leave about 6.30 in the morning from the pier, you can really take advantage of having no one around. And Alex has just said you can actually swim in this lagoon as well. So it's best to leave on a Pangnar tour either at 6.30 or at 10.30 or 7. Alex says 7 because he doesn't want to get up so early. Sean says 6.30 because he's already been up for 84 hours. Well, that's a nice backdrop though, look at that. That's stunning. Right, into the lagoon. Hello. Right, they've left, we're going in. Yeah, now let's see if Alex can get through this. Oh, Alex, look at that. I'm not going to move, and if I get hit, no. you reckon? Yeah, I'm a very good water taxi. Are you? Wow! Check this out. Ah, oh. that is the reason we come here when there's no one else here. Look at that. Ah. Oh. Come on a five star marine tour and Alex paddles. So we're in a little lagoon, just ourselves. And, um, sorry, look, there's my feet. It's the most peaceful thing in the world. Go and explore the joys of Pangna Bay. Look at them all. BJ likes a canoeing tour, that's for sure. Oh no! Ah! He looks happy, look. Hello, mate. <laughs> look at him. Oh boy. Cigarette on the go. Oh, hello. Perfect. <laughs> So we've sent Alex away to take the canoe back. Let's go, boys. Let's go, let's leave Alex. Don't worry about, bye Alex. Miss you. He's gone. When you come to Pangnar Bay, make sure you go canoeing. It's awesome, like all these people. 
Join us next time when James LeShark discovers a floating football pitch and then heads to Scaramanga's secret base at James Bond Island. James LeShark, come into a theatre near you. 